Welcome to episode sixteen seventy Chen Jisong teleconferencing billionaire from China nine lessons. This is an outline of episode sixteen seventy lesson one to five. This lesson six to nine. So one the business opportunity before Skype international calls in China could cost you a few months salary. Chen. And two others saw the opportunity. And two, the initial capital in two thousand and one. The initial capital for Yilin was one million yuans, or about one hundred fifty thousand U.S. dollars. And three, all three founders of Yilin became billionaires. By twenty twenty two, Chen Jisong has a net worth of one point seven billion dollars. Is fifty-six years old. The other two billionaire from Yilin are Zhou Jiwei, Wu Rongfu, also became a Yilin billionaire. Season four, the vision. 共同制定行业标准。陈志松表示，要将易联网络成为全球前五的视频会议解决方案提供商，成为更加具有国际影响力的民族品牌。Season five. Changing the business model for the first ten years, Yilin was an outsourced company. Chen decided to create his own brand and technology in 2011. Then six, the achievements of Yilin. It's a very successful company. It is fifth in the world in teleconferencing. Number one in SIP phones has presence in 140 countries. Then seven, the secrecy. The billionaire. We don't know much about him, except he's 56 years old. Does not grant interview. I cannot find any videos on him. He doesn't speak about the company or himself. And a partnership with Microsoft. And it is a chief technology partner of Microsoft and its teleconferencing team. The nine, the two product lines of Earlink. The first is teleconferencing. The second, are telephone equipments. Classes specifically room panel as room scheduling displays and room cast as room digital signage. This time at Zoomtopia. We are thrilled to announce two new products to the market. One is Meeting Bar A10. It is a compact but powerful all-in-one meeting bar, designed for huddle spaces and home office. The other is Meeting Board 65. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe and leave your questions and comments below. Wishing everyone peace and prosperity.